guys I thought I'd show off a little bit of my 3d printing set right here uh, I 3d printed two of these wall mounts put one on each side to hold that piece of wood it's called a wall halter and it's for all my filaments because my filaments were all over here and I didn't want to deal with the mess so now they're organized up there but I noticed that the pole is starting to droop in the middle because of the weight so this morning just got done 3D printing this thing. It's solid plastic. Thing's awesome. But thought I'd show a couple of uh, nice things right here. I made this shelf. Went to the store and I bought some uh, pipe. And I just kind of put it together. It's a decent looking shelf. But anyway, that's not the only thing. I mean, like when you need, like, like a COVID mask. Like I'll go to the store and I'll be wearing like a Bane mask, or like. This is like, this is wall mounts for uh, like Oculus Quest controllers. Or if you want to add, you know, parts for your 3D printer, there, a mount right there for the uh, spatula that takes that off. Uh, this wheel right here, 3D printed that, made that. It's an entire thing I've printed. It makes the plastic going easier. Or a shelf, like I 3D printed this shelf. It's a floating wall shelf. It's so cool, and it opens up, and you can hide your stuff in there. Really cool. Or, if you're into games, I 3D printed this uh, little wall mount for the controller. There's two more shelves. Or, <laughs> I got another shelf. I really like these shelves. I, I designed this shelf. It's pretty good. Or... You know, like my previous video, when I built this stuff, I made some decorative, you know, wall brackets for another shelf I made. Glued some, uh, some ram sticks, put a little Bitcoin on there. <laughs> BLM is racist. Of course it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, then I 3D printed this thing. Because, you know those, uh, what's it called? Those things that, that makes the sticks, the incense sticks, holds up. And it was getting everywhere, and it was disgusting. So then, you know, I found this thing online, 3D printed that, and it's vertical, so it catches all the, uh, ugh, is it going in right? Yeah. So it catches all the dust that, you know, falls down. Oh, yeah, and I want to show this too. So, so here's my virtual reality Oculus setup right here, and I needed a mount for that, so instead of buying one on Amazon for like six, seven dollars, I just 3D printed my own thing right there, put some screws in it. Before, I had a uh, big ass nail going through my wall, and I'm like, no, that's just not going to work. So I bought that instead. Uh, then I printed these things, a little wall mount for my controllers I just showed, and for the Quest, 3D printed that as well. Just download it on the internet, and it just works. Awesome. Me and my brother were joking like 20 years ago when we were kids. You know, one of these days. You're going to be able to like go on some online forums and just like download some skateboard some other kid designed. Like, oh man, yeah, let me download that skateboard. But then I find out, you know, I go on YouTube and it's like this guy 3D printed a pair of shoes with a rubber filament and the shoes are actually working. All right, we're living in the future right here.